Hello traders, welcome back to Learn to Trade YouTube channel. So today I will talk about uh, I will talk about gold, I will talk about the yellow metal, I will talk about a deeper drop as the price action confirmed a potential uh, potential larger sell off. So um, here is the disclaimer. Please read it. It's important to understand the risks. And uh, but, I don't know if you have questions, you can uh, you can send an email to support. And uh, if you want to to become a VIP member. You can access the link posted right below this video and for only 40 uh, pounds per per month you can uh, you can become a vip member yeah you can uh, of course if you want to follow all our trades if you want to get all our trades if you want to follow our trade management if you want to to get all our vip content so um after this uh, strong downside movement here a uh, rebound as you can see here on the on the one hour chart, let's uh, let's use also uh, uh, Fibonacci retracement here on this uh, on this rebound, and you can see that um, that the price of uh, that the price of gold uh, failed to to stabilize above the thirty eight point two above this um, this resistance uh, resistance level uh, eighteen sixty seven point seventy 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 eight. It has failed here to stabilize above um, one thousand eight hundred sixty nine point seventy two sell off strong sell off and uh, also here maybe in the short term maybe we had the. Uh, something like a range pattern sideways movement in the short term so only false breakouts uh, and these false breakouts here signal it maybe a valid breakdown and uh, downside continuation okay so right now is located far below the 23.6 is located uh, below um, 1828.54 it after this uh, strong sell off rebound retest and right now a uh, new sell off in the short term unfortunately and uh, the reason why i'm not uh, i'm not short right now here uh, for the vip members um, is only because uh, um, yeah i've had this uh, this pin bar here rebound maybe i'll uh, i'll wait to see how it will react maybe here around uh, one uh, 1812.24 point, point okay because uh, I don't want uh, the price only to to hit this level and to rebound but as I've said technically after um, uh, these uh, false breakouts above the 38.2 uh, above this former high um, signaled that uh, the rebound ended and that the, the yellow metal could drop deeper okay and uh, if you are a VIP member you already know that uh, personally I have a pending order in silver okay it's the same uh, like like gold maybe so uh, yeah if you are not a VIP member maybe you'll miss uh, another uh, high probability trade uh, really really good trade so about gold as I've said rebound which uh, ended here and right now a uh, strong sell-off retest and uh, in my opinion and uh, technically maybe a new lower low yeah uh, could activate a potential potential deeper drop but in the, actually in the short term maybe personally I would like to see something like a, like a sideways movement extended sideways movement here maybe the price to come back to test retest uh, and uh, this sideways movement an extended sideways movement here could represent uh, something like uh, like a distribution pattern a new range before extending its sell-off don't forget that uh, tomorrow we'll have the FOMC the Federal Reserve is expected to to continue hiking rates is expected to increase the federal funds rate uh, from 1.00% to 1.50%. Um, so uh, anything could happen. The volatility could be high around the FOMC. Also, we have the retail sales. So you'll have to be careful. But uh, technically, and in my opinion, technically, the bias is bearish here after this uh, after this uh, sell-off rebound. And right now it could maybe it could uh, resume its uh, its drop, guys. Okay. So uh, also because uh, here it has failed. One moment. Will I will use also this key level? It has failed to reach. Actually, yeah, it has reached and uh, this key level, uh, one thousand eight hundred seventy-seven. Only false uh, false breakout. New lower low, and uh, yeah, as I've said, a new lower low in here could uh, signal potential uh, potential deeper drop okay uh this is my opinion here and uh maybe 
Uh, actually, yeah, as I've said, uh, personally, I have a pending order in uh, in silver uh, on metals, and maybe if I'll have uh, a new high probability trade here, maybe after a new lower low or after an extended sideways movement in the short term, I will uh, maybe I will take action because personally, I'm looking only for shorts right now in gold. Okay, um, thank you guys. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Follow us on Instagram.